You're watching CBS 42, local coverage you can count on. This is CBS 42 News at 6. We're back tonight as dozens of West Alabama teachers toured the Mercedes-Benz plant today. Now, Tim Reed shows us it's part of an effort to give future job opportunities to students. 81 educators toured the Mercedes-Benz plant. It's a workforce development program that showcases employment opportunities to help students find good jobs in the automotive industry. The Mercedes-Benz plant is always on the lookout for new employees who need good jobs. We produce approximately 300,000 cars a year. Dozens of teachers, principals, and school counselors from seven different West Alabama school systems got a chance to see this automotive plant up close. Today we're focusing on the automotive industry, which is, as we know, is booming in West Alabama with Mercedes and all the surrounding suppliers. So they're learning about the opportunities that they can tell their students about that they can apply for really cool jobs, apprenticeships, and training opportunities when they finish high school. Heather Whitley is a school counselor at Fayette County High School. She tells CBS 42 this is a great opportunity to help her students find a career. I hope to um, teach our students to explore these uh, positions so that they can get a job in 2020 and hopefully be successful when they become adults. We have a battery plant and electric vehicles coming our way. It's really important that we have the workforce available <laughs> for those great jobs ahead of us. These educators are hoping this experience will help the next generation become successful. I think it's awesome to equip the, uh, the educators and what to tell the students. Uh, real time, real money uh, figures, the efficiency of these plants that we're touring right now. The workforce development program meets four times a year to focus on different industries in Alabama. In Tuscaloosa County, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.